former finance minister Mr. Titombo Weni uh oh Mr. Titombo Weni guys uti uti Titombo Weni this is not a government of national unity it's a coalition not a government of national unity well I've got that video as well so I'm gonna have to play you that video so you hear it or so you see it yourself so give me a few minutes I will do exactly that. I'm very capable of doing that. Um, we told you that uh, to those of you, they thought they said the GNU is a government of national unity. And I said, uh uh, the GNU is a government of national confusion. Tara, where's my lapamangam? Tara, lapamangam. Quite sure, no more. Kulengo mangim dal, Nesula dal. Awo himu malumegini. Aike pengonzi esbae nesayo. Hapa mangami awo himu malumegi. I did not say the name of the artist. Kora jengi temina. Yeah, why isho lo mounye? So, I told you. There is a lie. So, Tikambo Wen says, this is not a government of national unity. It's a coalition. Uh, right, let me, let me get this one. Former finance minister Tito Mboweni believes the incoming new government national of national unity is nothing more than simple coalition government. Will you agree or disagree? I've got a video of the man speaking for himself. Um, also, he, he, the citizen has translated that Ufenzal Paten. A senior digital journalist has translated thought into writing and added some bit of a comment out of there and there as well, which I find it very interesting. So I've got the video got Tito Mboween saying, uh -uh, I don't confuse the local government of national unity with the coalition. First of all, if we say if he says that, will you disagree, judging from the arrogance of ETA from the beginning? Remember. We've made multiple videos, content creators, different content creators. We've made multiple videos telling you that this is not... In fact, I've never seen even a single content creator that like, made a video and said that this is actually a government and national unity as they portray it. Everybody has been clear on the matter that no man... Because people are not dumb. They're right. People have been seeing that no man, this is not a, a, a government of national unity, but rather... It's a government of uh, the coalition of between DA and ANC. I'm glad that a person of uh, a seniority such as uh, such as Utidombaweni also speaks the truth and says, no, 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 no. Ah, don't lie. This is not a government of national unity, right? But before I pursue that point anywhere further, well, there are quite a number of things that I want you to do, right? In fact, I'm very confused. Why people hasn't done this? If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, good people. Because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, it is free of charge. To click the notification bell, it is free of charge. To share this video, it is free of charge. To watch this video until the end, it is free of charge. Also, good people, I mean, come on, to watch the ads, it's free of charge, and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financially contribution to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as little as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the Super Thanks Party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? will bring you more and also guys want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed he said first of first of the environment the, the environment is totally different in 19 it is totally different in 1994 we were coming from, we were coming out of negotiations involving all parties during those days, it was agreed that an instant constitution should be agreed upon. Therefore, that constitution brought about a government of national unity. That government was a transitional government because it was the 
It was a transition from the apartheid government to the new one that will be elected Mboweni said. Well, that's a video of the man explaining this very nicely and put it into context very nicely. So I'm going to place this video here. Don't worry. Just give me this moment. The context is different now. What we have now is not a transitional government. It is an, uh, look, it's an attempt at trying to form a government because the elections were not decisive. No party was big enough to form, uh, to form a government on its own. Therefore, it's actually not a government of national unity at all. At all. It's not a government of national unity. Government of national confusion. <laughs> uh, like, come on, guys. Come on. You wouldn't agree with me. It's a government of national confusion, not of unity. That's fair. Let's take a look at what Utitum. <laughs> take a look at what Utitum says about the government of national confusion. Here. Yeah. Those negotiations, it was agreed that an interim constitution should be agreed upon. Therefore, that constitution brought about a government of national unity. That government is very important to note this. That government was a transitional government. It was to transit from the apartheid government to the new one that would be elected um, um, uh, you know, on the 27th uh, of May, the, the, of April, I think it was. Now, that was a transitional government. It was composed based on the interim constitution. It was ANC, National Party, and Inkata Freedom Party. During that process of this interim government, a constitution was being written, if you recall. And the constitution was finalized in 1996, and that government of national unity came to an end. The National Party left the government, but fortunately the IFP stayed on. So you had the government basically of the ANC and uh, the Inkata Freedom Party. Context is different now. Right. What we have now is not a transitional government. It's an attempt at trying to form a government because the elections were not decisive. No party was big enough to form a government on its own. And therefore, this is actually not a government of national unity at all. Mm. This is a coalition government of the parties which have not been able to get more than 50% of the vote. And I would like to insist on this. Conceptually, this is not a government of national unity we're talking about. We're talking about a coalition of parties to form a government. And I think that's very important. Is a GNU a Faustian pact? It's the question, sir, you asked on X. Um, Faustian, my understanding is that it's basically something that is done for present gain uh, without regard of future cost or consequence. What's your concern, sir? I want to emphasize once again that conceptually we're not dealing with a government of national unity here. We're dealing with a coalition uh, of parties to try and form a government. Okay. So he continues to say this is a coalition of parties which have not been able to get more than 50% of the vote and will be like, look, I would like to insist on this. Um, conceptually, this is not a government of national unity that we are uh, talking about. We are talking about a coalition of parties to form a government and I think that's very important, says Umboweni, 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 Umbox. <laughs> um, now, you see, guys, this is my problem. My problem is the smartness, if I may say, the smartness of the people who who always see themselves as the smartest among everybody else, such as the 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 the, the, the DA. Uh, people were warned from the beginning and people were told that this is not a government of, of, of this is not a national government this is a coalition between DA and ANC today we're seeing it for what it is 
Look at the terms, the, look at DA dictating terms, saying, but you have signed an agreement with us. That agreement says you can't add anybody else except you consult us. And you still want to tell us a government of national unit? No. Rather, it's a government of national confusion, a government of national corruption. Right? You want to eat those money together. But it's not a government of national unity at all. Actually, if you zoom deep into the air, look into it, you realize, no, actually, it's a coalition here between EA and Walla, ANC. We can't beat around the bush about that. It's a fact. Now, I have to it will, it will be injustice if I don't do this. Really, guys, it will be injustice. If I don't ask you this question, having observed the behavior of ETA in this whole thing, having looked very closely at the behavior of ETA and ANC, really will you say this is a government of national unity or it's a government of it's a collision between DA and ANC. I will easily conclude. Look at the fact. I will easily conclude that it's a government of. Look, it's a government of. Uh, uh, look, it's a collision between ANC and DA. Just look at the, the demands of ETA. Just look at the demands alone. They want to be made the 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 the, 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 the deputy president. They want portfolios that are very important. They don't want a police. They don't want a police department. They don't want this. They want. For, for that reason, the A is dictating terms. And that worries me. Maybe you're not. Probably. Well, you should be worried. Because if you're not worried, I'm worried about you, that you're not worried about this worrying thing. Hmm. I was rhyming. No, I was not, it was, that was not intentional per se, but I was rhyming. I will be worried about you that you're not worried about this worrying thing. Let me leave it there with the hope that you will now be worried.